How's it going guys? We are back with another video here and these are the best goalies to buy in February for NHL 24 Hockey Ultimate Team. Make sure you leave a like, subscribe if you have not already, and let's hop into this video right now. We're giving budgets for every price range, so these, these goalies I'm about to mention are kind of like, hey, you know what? They are really good, don't get me wrong, but obviously they could be a little bit risky because, I mean, they are 78 overalls, right? Bill B, I think that's how you pronounce it, he goes for about 3,000 coins. And the big thing with him is he's 6'7", 222 pounds. His size is crazy. I actually played against him yesterday in a game, and I was stunned by the saves he was making. He takes up so much of the net, and it's a really, really hard goalie to score on, and it, I, I get very frustrated playing against him. So I think he's an option for sure if you guys don't really have a ton of coins that you want to spend on a goaltender. Mad Sogar, he's another one that goes for around 6,000 coins, 3,000 coins. You're not going to spend too much on him. Under 10,000 coins for sure. Same thing, though, 6'7", 196. I'd probably rather have Hildeby just because he you know, weighs a little bit more. That weight could actually make a difference. He'll be a little bit bigger in the net. But Sogard still is very good, too. He's another great option. It's crazy that 76 overall goalies in February are actually potential options of good goalies. That's just how this game's made, right? I mean, big goalies kind of rule the world, unfortunately. So that's how it is. Sogard and Hildeby, to me, are the, kind of like the two budget guys. But now let's get into the more high overall and it's more expensive guys. First with Jake Ottinger, and he does go for a lot. He goes for about 130,000 coins. He's six foot five, 220 pounds, left-handed. Uh, synergies don't really matter again, but I'll mention them, I guess, because he has a bunch. Defensive boost, playmaking boost, along with agile dangling boost and the speed boost. He's got tons of abilities too. He's got Silver Energizer, Silver Light Work, Silver Showstopper, and Gold Post to Post here. Uh, I would probably mainly go for the Showstopper. I'd activate that, uh, and I'd probably activate, I would say Light Work. I mean, I don't think Post to Post is really that necessary on a goalie that's big. I don't know, 6'5 to me is pretty good regardless. All stats are in the 90s except for just a few, so I mean, he's... He's pretty much everything you could really ask for in a goaltender, and he's played very well. It's just crazy how he's, you know, 91 overall in the All-Star cards. The goalies are the highest rated of them all, so who would have thought? But Jake Onger for me, is absolutely a great option. M mentioned Jacob Markstrom here. Jacob Markstrom at 6'6", 207 pounds. He's a left-handed goalie here. Playmaking boost and defensive boost synergy. Markstrom is always my goalie. I'm going to be honest. I've, I've used Markstrom pretty much the whole year. Uh, whether it's the right decision or not, you know, that's, I guess, arguable. But I've used Markstrom for so long now, uh, and he gets it done. I, I've used 86, I've used his 87. There's been so many different Markstroms that I've used this year. And for me, I always just keep going back to him. I don't know if it's, if it's smart or not, but I've been doing it. He's got silver butterfly effect. He's got gold showstopper as well. So those are great abilities, in my opinion, at least for a goalie. Any ability for goalies that makes them not you know, drain energy really quickly and start flopping around the net, to me is a positive. So I always recommend trying to activate the abilities with this the uh, energy bar, but Markstrom is good. He really is. I mean, every high rated Markstrom that keeps coming out, I mean, you would think their card would play better, uh, you would think. So for me, Jacob Markstrom, 87 overall here. Um, he's, uh, he's a beast. He really is. I recommend him to you guys for sure. 87 Thatcher Demko. He doesn't go for too much. He goes for around 25,000 coins. He's six foot four, 192 pounds. He's got silver light work along with gold butterfly effect here. Uh, he's, he's a really good card. Demko plays well in game. I've used his card on PS5 a lot. I think I use his 86 a decent amount on PS5 and he's good. He, he really is. Gold Butterfly effect is nice too. Silver Light Work does a good combo of abilities here too. Um, for me, Demko sometimes he has some really rough games though. From you know my experience of playing with him at least, but I think overall he's a very good option. I mean, all of these goalies that I'm mentioning today, I really think are pretty good, and, and you can get away with using and not be like, oh, this goalie is so bad. I mean, they should all be decent enough for you guys. And a big thing with goaltenders in NHL is really how good you play on defense too. I mean, if you're letting up wide open back doors, I mean, they're not making many saves goalies. They're just simply not. That's just how it is, right? I mean, you, you, you have a team of the year, McDavid, make a cross-ice pass, a team of the year, McDavid. I mean, really, who, who can you really be mad if it goes in? I don't think you should be. Should it go in 100% of the time? No, but, you know, you, you kind of just hope for one or two saves from that, I guess, a game. And, and I think these goalies will do that for you. So Thatcher Demko, for me, is another great option, and I reckon, I would definitely recommend recommend him to you guys. Connor Hellebuck. Connor Hellebuck at 6'4", 216 pounds here. He's got speed boost, defensive boost, along with silver light work. 
and gold showstopper here. Uh, I like this card. I do. Hellbuck plays fantastic in game. As you guys can probably sense a theme, I'm pretty much mainly talking about 6-4 plus goalies. Those are like kind of the, the main ones. So, I don't know. I'm a big fan of Hellebuck. I am, guys. Um, to me, he's he's good. I recommend him. I, I think he, he really have a lot of fun using this card. He, he's a really solid goaltender. And it, it's the ability to do it for me, too. I mean, gold showstopper is tremendous. I mean, it helps with the energy. Like, you don't get drained as much. And, and they should be solid for you. So, I recommend uh, Connor Hellebuck to you guys 100%. I think he's a, a really, really good option for you. But it's kind of relatively cheap. Around 25,000 coins. It's Mackenzie Blackwood here. And Blackwood's another goalie that I've seen a lot of people have been using this year. And for right reasons. I mean, I I was there since the beginning. I mean, back in NHL 20, Mackenzie Blackwood's... Uh, what was it called? The... Uh, oh, my goodness. How am I, how am I not remember uh, that car that he had? The MSP from, from NHL 20. I can't remember what it was exactly called. But uh, it was such a good event. Uh, but 6'4", 225 pounds. He's got speed boost and defensive boost. His ability options are Silver Lightwork and Gold Whirlwind. I mean, that gold ability is pretty awful, I gotta say. Uh, but uh, I would say Silver Lightwork is, uh, is is really nice on him. And, and Blackwood just plays well in game. I even say abilities aside, even if you don't have abilities. I think even, uh, I'm gonna say this right now, guys. I think abilities are a bit overrated, maybe, on goalies this year. Like I, I think, like... Maybe the energy ones are kind of important, but after that, I don't think it's like a huge deal to activate like post to post and all that. Like, like if you don't, if you can't, if you feel like you want to activate on your forwards defense, I don't think it's gonna kill you. I really don't. So, uh, just let you guys know that as well. But I like Blackwood's card a lot. He plays well in game. Uh, to me, he's uh, he's always one of my favorite cards out there. Uh, I, I gotta honestly probably get him for my all time Devils team. I mean, because what what other, what other goalies do we have? I mean, Brodora, yeah, but. Uh, I mean, that's that's really just about it. <laughs> so, yeah, I mean, I, I like Brodor. I mean, I like Blackwood. Sorry, not Brodor. Um, and to me, he's uh, he's a great option for you guys. He really is. So um, let's move on to the last goal I wanted to mention. Or newer cars that came out the other day when they released all those, you know, Gallery of Greats goalies. It's going to be Roberto Luongo. Roberto Luongo, he's 6'3", so you're thinking, well, Henrik gets a little bit undersized. Not really. I mean, 6'3", still pretty tall, for being honest. 6'3", 217 pounds, left-handed goalie. He's got options of accelerator boost, speed boost, and then defensive boost, playmaking boost. Uh, you got 90 high, 90 stick high. Silver extra padding. That's what could be interesting as well because of the changes to goalies they made. Silver silver Whirlwind, I'm not a huge fan of. Silver Energizer is good, though. And finally, Gold Lightwork. I played against Luongo a decent amount. He's been playing very well. I know many people have been using him, and I've also really liked Luongo's card. I think Luongo is an awesome card, and I think he's a great option in that here. And for me, all these goalies are great options. If you have any questions about any of these goalies, and if, I, I want you guys to let me know as well in the comment section down below who you're using in that and who's working for you. If, if it's in any of these goalies, if it's not, who? I'm really curious because I'm always looking for a goalie, and I'm always looking to make more videos on best goalies to get, and you guys give good advice and opinions. So thanks so much for watching, guys. Hey, guys, thanks so much for watching this video. Hopefully you did enjoy it. Please make sure you leave a like. Subscribe if you have not already, and follow me on Twitch, Henrik, Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, Henrik three E's, and be sure to join my Discord to talk to me, followers, and subscribers to the channel, and I'll see you guys all in the next video.